are tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Well, guys, we're going to be talking about Deshaun Watson because the wait is now over. His 11 game suspension is now complete. He will return next week or this week and play against his old team, the Houston Texans in Houston. Now, this season for the Texans is pretty forgivable. They are a dumpster fire. I believe their record is um one, nine and one, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's a shit show out here in Houston. So I find it kind of funny, that guys, that he's actually coming back to face his old team where all of the accusations came to light. The Texans provided him with a hotel to handle his business, so to speak. But all of that now is in the past. He's going to be going back to NRG to face the music in Houston this week. And he's going to have some special guests there to greet him as well. Here we go, guys, on TMZ Sports. Deshaun Watson accusers attending Browns game first time since suspension. They will be there to greet Deshaun Watson. And boy, I've been in NRG. It is super duper loud in there. Um, Fans are definitely going to have to bring their earplugs because there's nothing on the field to actually see with the Texans that trash. Everybody's going to have all eyes on one Deshaun Watson. The booze will be immense, but there's also going to be a bunch of his accusers in attendance to greet him. It says here, the booze for Deshaun Watson will be a bit louder when the Brown star takes the field in Houston Sunday. Ten of his accusers will be in the building to watch the controversial QB play his first game since his suspension ended. Around 10 women, along with their attorney, attorney uh, Tony Busby, will be inside a suite at NRG Stadium for the 1 p.m. Eastern game, according to The Athletic. Pitting 27-year-old Watson against his old organization, the Texans, who drafted him in 2017. Now, guys, I have not watched a Texans game all season. I'm actually not a fan of the Texans. I just live in Houston. I'm a Cowboys fan. I think I'm actually going to tune into this one, you know, at least for the first quarter, because I want to see the crowd reaction to Deshaun Watson. This is what uh, Tony Busby said, quote, I will be there to welcome Deshaun back to Houston. Busby told the athletic saying he'd be there with bells and whistles on. It's unclear which of the more than two dozen women who sued Watson, almost all have settled, will be attending the game. Buzzy says he invited all of his clients, but some declined. As for why they go to watch him play, Busby wishes to send Deshaun a message. Quote, you think you put us behind you, but we are still here. Of course, Watson was suspended 11 games and fined $5 million this offseason after scores of female massage therapists accuse him of acting inappropriately during sessions. He hasn't been seen in action since January 3rd, 2021. Yeah, it's been almost two years, guys. Two years. But are you guys actually going to be tuning in to see what actually happens to Deshaun Watson? I mean, this game is pretty forgettable from a football standpoint. Both teams are terrible. I don't believe that Deshaun Watson is really going to make much of a difference on this team whatsoever. To tell you the truth, this season is done. They stink. The Texans stink. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans, Deshaun Watson returns to the field for the first time in almost two years. And he's not going to get a warm welcome whatsoever out here in Houston. A lot of Texans fans actually don't like the way that he decided, you know what? I don't want to play anymore. I want to be traded after he actually signed a massive deal. Then that's when the wheels fell off and his legal troubles started with a, with around something like 30 women or something an insane number, folks. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans. Let us know stick about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. We'll catch you next time. 
Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.